I they're extremely them. stretchy and she had to wear three X and, and now white. They're definitely private. giving free people on a budget. Oh, I'm they're definitely giving. It's really sad that you're already at the top of the sizes before you've even bloomed. Hello, beautiful people. It's Mama Goob. So today I see that Alexandra Rodriguez just uploaded her Sunday vlog just a couple hours ago. So I figured we'd take a look at it together. The weather's beautiful today. The birds are chirping. The wind is blowing. So it wasn't blowing when I made this decision. But now it is. So hopefully it won't be too, too bad for you. Anyways, guys, let's get on with it to see what Alex has in store for us today. Okay, so hair appointment, spring Amazon haul, plus a day in my life. So she's been getting shit from people who don't want her to get her hair dyed. I was like that, I was afraid to get my hair dyed. I don't know if that's so important anymore, but let's see what she's got. Ah, this is gonna make me cry. Hey you guys, welcome back to a new vlog. We are heading out to get the hair done today. Good, you get your super hair excited. Did. Like my hair has been growing so fast just the last couple years taking prenatals while we were trying to get pregnant. And I feel like the roots have just been coming in yep. so quickly. And then when they come in quickly, when I put my hair up, which is pretty often, it ends up looking really dark. I don't really mind, but there is nothing better than a blonde refresh. Oh, 100%. But I also know I'm not so I get, um, I get what's called God's highlights over here, the gray. So I could go a good two months between um, dyes because I have God's highlights. Only one who, when they get their hair done, they need to do full makeup. I cannot appreciate the hair if I don't have on well, like a full maybe glam. So full. I'm even gonna put lashes on, which I know. So the reason why I don't like full full is because when they wash it, they usually get like, stuff here where they have to clean off so you have this like line never do anymore oh that primer smells so weird and it's not old it's like pretty new some products laura just mercier stink. perfecting oh stinky i'm gonna go in with the house labs today which i kind of have forgotten to reach for if you don't like the makeup portion of this i'm not gonna do the whole thing on camera Good. i just wanted to come on I and it's not that i don't like the makeup portion i don't like when she speeds herself up and puts music in that I usually get caught up on if I forget to edit out. Intro the vlog and let you guys know what we're up to today. I've been sweet. doing like a very natural makeup with my Color Science SPF, but it's so nice to get like that full coverage. And I feel like it matches my neck really well. This is the okay. House Labs Triclone and it's in the shade. It's like a cyclone. 100 Light Neutral. And this morning I was just editing, um, Thursday's vlog, which will already be up when you guys are watching this one. And we're actually going to visit some of Yara's relatives this weekend. The ones Ooh. with the super cute little baby girl. So I'm so excited to go and see them. We're bringing the dog. But never shall the two families clash, huh? And I think our dogs are going to get along so well. They have like a golden doodle. And I think Bruno is going to love playing with him. Because they'll send us videos of him and they totally act the same. Oh. There's nothing like a full glam when you haven't done it in a while. It makes you really appreciate the bronzer stick again. <laughs> I, I do have bronzer, a return to bring to Target and a return to bring to USPS. But whether we do that today or tomorrow is a mystery. All right, let's speed through the rest of this makeup. Oh, yay! Music! All right, guys, let's see six and a half hours later okay you guys i am back home we all know getting oh, your hair done is nice. like an all-day affair it is almost six and i she looks love nice it. it is fresh i'm actually toned a bleach and yeah i like how it's a little bit shorter here she looks really nice tone as they say on tiktok um and we did like a slightly brighter mm -hmm. money piece in the front and she looks yeah, nice it looks so good Good morning, you guys. Now it's she the looks next like day. Shit. I was so pooped last night. 
didn't end up vlogging and I'm pretty sure my camera even died <laughs> when I was showing you guys my hair last night uh, when I got home but we just ended up eating leftovers and watching Buying Beverly Hills really good season but yeah here is my hair today the blowout actually held up pretty well overnight but I do I love how we did a little bit brighter in the front yeah it's cute and like she does a little root tap to make the grow out look better but oh I just so, good. We so we're heading down to visit um, one of our family members a for a couple days and we're leaving tomorrow. So oh, I need to wow. fold laundry today, pack, make sure I have everything for Bruno and yeah, super excited to just get away for a few days. Boy, does that bookshelf look stupid and have some quality family time. Uh, I do have a very small Amazon haul that I've been accumulating and everything has now officially come in. So I figured I would do my little haul with some good like spring finds and just stuff I would have ordered regardless. <laughs> okay, first and foremost, I have been dying for a pair of Sambas. I think they're so cute. Sambas? I am definitely, I say it all the time. Must be a I'm a trend topic. follower. I love following a good trend, so of course. judge me yes, if you want, it's what I like. And I think they look so cute. You guys know the last like year or so, I started loving like dresses with sneakers. Um, especially in like spring and summer. No, I hate that. It's really look. casual but cute. So I finally grabbed a pair. I just ordered them through Amazon because I love that <laughs> quick ship. I actually ordered a pair of men's. So fun little fact. I mean, oh, I think everyone ugly. kind of knows this. Um, if you have wide feet. So the only thing is, I get she bought it through Amazon, and I get that. But especially this weekend, Rakuten three times the cash back, Estee Lauder, because I was going to do Sephora because I'm like out of everything, and I was going to get Estee Lauder primer. Not only was Estee Lauder's on, on sale, like the Sephora, but you got 15% cash back or something crazy. Maybe it was nine. I don't remember, but you're silly to buy on Amazon because there's no cash back on Amazon. Some things. But I agree with her. It is quicker ship and it's easier. Um, you can just order men's. So I got a men's 8.5, which is a women's 10. And how Those freaking are ugly. cute are these? I am so They're in love. Not for me. I love the green. They look like soccer shoes. It's got a little bit of gray at the top. And I like how the Samba accent here is in gold. Has to. So yeah, yes. I just, I think these are. Well, that's super important that the Samba, whatever the fuck that means, is prominent. Otherwise, why bother? So stylish, so cute for spring. Ooh. Lately, I've been living in my New Balances, so I'm excited to have a different pair to mix it up, and my mm. New Balances are all very neutral. So I love that these have a little pop of color, but like subtle. Because oddly enough, I feel like you can mix green with a lot, you know? Okay, and then also, I've been on a hat kick. I do find it funny, I why? used to not she like trucker hats. Hair. And what do you know? I like trucker hats now, probably because I see everyone wearing them looking super cute. Yes, yeah, that's exactly it. And guys, I look ridiculous in any hat. My head is so huge. So I don't care if the uh, queen herself was wearing a hat. I, I couldn't do it. Again, not ashamed to admit I love following a trend, but I think they're so you adorable. No I always loved baseball hats anyway, but I never used to really like the like netted back. I will say they are nice for um, ventilation. They are less hot, which is perfect for spring and summer. So first, I got this one that says, have a nice day. And then it has the brand logo right here. This is super nice quality. I love this one. It's just like so easy to throw on and just- I think she looks ridiculous. Know, feel kind of cute and put together. No. And then how cute is this green one with the Samba? It's just like even with jeans and a white tee. Like so simple, but like so cute. This one just says, Joe's Surf Shop here. I love it. It's so simple. I did order another one, but it hasn't come yet. It's like a longer shipping. So I'll show you it when it comes in. It's kind of funny. So yeah, I definitely want to like plan a cute outfit with this little combo deal. Okay, I grabbed an apron. I have one apron and she has seen better days. Um, it was cheap. I've had it for I've a long time and it's just an neutral. So I wanted to grab one with a pattern and I just thought this looked very, very anthropology-esque. I'll link all this down below. And when you click on this apron, they had a bunch of really beautiful designs. I got um, one for depending Easter. if you want something a little less busy or not, but they had so many cute options. Like, I keep are you to wear it. That's kidding cute. me? This is the orange. cutest thing ever. I, I am in love with this design. I think I'm definitely stepping into a more 
motherly aesthetic. I used to just love all neutrals and I don't know, really crisp and clean and simple, but now I'm kind of into like little pops of color, simple, designs, just like patterns. Her. So oh, no, I think this basic. is so cute. I think it's absolutely adorable. It might not I fit her like for all very long. On it. Flowers, the patterns, the colors, and I just feel like it's so springy and cozy. Yeah, I love oranges. Uh, I'm a Florida girl, what can I say? And I just like want to cook in this. Let's talk hydration. The girl has one 40 ounce tumbler. The Stanley situation actually really freaked me out. We no longer what? have our Stanleys, what? so wait, I bought wait, wait, this wait, wait, hydro wait, wait, flask. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa. Didn't she just use the Stanley in the last video? I could have sworn I saw Stanley there. And so what's the Stanley stuff? What's the Stanley problem? I don't know. Did bad PR get them? What, what happened? Like, Stanley? Did she hint that there was lead in them? Like, if so, how? Why? Like, that doesn't even make sense. They haven't used, like, lead paints, lead anything since the 70s. One here. Um, and I think it's really great, 40 ounce. Shouldn't have any lead from my research. And you want to know what's funny, too? Yar was always, like, a Hydro Flask and Yeti person, even before the whole Stanley craze. And honestly, I feel like, I like the Hydro Yeti. Flask and the Yeti are, like the best ones in my opinion and then the lid just pops off it doesn't screw on which is another great thing so yeah I, I have a water with me all the time this is the brand that I have now I don't need like a million tumblers but when this one's dirty it would be nice to have just another option I got this one in PR it's from a brand called Takeya uh 40 ounce I love that the Break. bottom is silicone and you set it down it's not like clunky this is honestly like a really good one. I probably should have just bought another one of this brand. Yeah, it's what they wanted um, you to do. I don't know. So if you want a good brand, I'll link both of them. I love this one. Like I said, that silicone bottom is so freaking nice. And I feel like it just works really well. And it's cute and light blue. So we love it. Oh, the holy grail. The holy grail. If you watch the Florida vlogs, these shorts. <laughs> these are shorts. These shorts. I have them in pink and black. And ordered the white i hope they're not sold out yet for you guys to grab uh, no, these thank athletic you. shorts catch me in them all summer period especially as the pregnancy bump grows what is the best about these this band is so thick and long i guess you it's could put so it under your stretchy belly. this is so silky soft like, I don't know, the fabric just feels very cooling and refreshing. And it has a double layer. So the shorts underneath, like these might ride up because that's thick life in a nutshell. But then there's a flowy short over it. So if they're even, even if they're riding up, the front flowy short part doesn't ride up. I took a walk with my mom in these every morning on vacation and they did not they ride up. Um, I day. do recommend probably sizing up because these are a 3X. They look more like a 2X in my opinion. They are extremely stretchy though. So do it that way Holy you will. Shit. These are the 3X. I They're extremely them. stretchy the and she had to wear 3X. And, and now white. They're definitely pregnant. giving free people on a budget. Oh, I'm They're definitely giving... It's really sad that you're already at the top of the sizes before you've even bloomed. That's what's sad. I'm so excited about this. I'm so excited about this. This is so freaking cute. I actually want to set this up right now. Ah, this is going to make me cry. I wanted to put the sonogram in something. And I found this little countdown calendar on Amazon. They had so many That's options, cute. but I liked this one so much. So it's like a picture frame. I thought I broke it. I did not. Oh, um, look at that. And it has it's on electronic weeks. Oh, that's cute. Until we meet you, little one. And then you put the sonogram picture right here. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, okay how many that's weeks? Cute. How many weeks until September 29th? All right, 24 weeks. She doesn't know. Six months exactly. Like, you don't realize when you're younger. That she doesn't know how pregnant she is. Huh. That you um, are pregnant for like a full. 40. 40 weeks like you know you always say 36 weeks i just feel like that's what you always hear but no it's like it's 40 it's 40 because it's like i'm four months pregnant but i have six months to go you got 10 months i think because when you find out you're technically four weeks you know so it's kind of funny but all right so cute let me let me pop the little flat the most recent sonogram we have okay i gotta finagle it a little bit but i think this is so adorable and then every week we can like change the countdown because it feels cute. like it feels like christmas doing a little christmas countdown okay All right, this is gonna bother me I, I gotta put this in perfectly and show you <laughs> okay here it is in all its glory 
until we get our next ultrasound. But you can see his little face. I posted that picture before, but mm -hmm. isn't this cute? I don't know. I it love is. a good countdown, mm -hmm. and um, it's just such an exciting time. So I think this it is, really ah, is so cute. Guys, All right, a couple of car restocks. I always keep lotion and lip balm in the car, and I just ran out. So trying a new little lippy here. This is the Laneige Lip Glowy Balm. I've tried this before, but this is in peach which just sounded nice and springy. I love this stuff. It gives you such a gorgeous glow. It honestly reminds me of the sleeping lip mask um, in a tube. See how it gives you that nice pretty glow? Oh, I just love it. And then for hand cream, I love the L'Occitane uh, Amande. It's the almond one. It just, I love the smell of almond. Yeah, anything, it smells so. nice. I love that. Oh uh, yeah, just some car restocks. They're the perfect little size for your purse or your car. So I usually just buy a cheap pair. She seems like the type though that would have the um the purell whatever she probably has that too slippers like once or twice a year and just wear the crap out of them <laughs> my cherry ones have been long gone and now i've been wearing my skims the fluffy ones for like a couple months and they are my winter slippers so i went ahead and grabbed these for a spring summer Indoor are ugly. Shoe house slipper. I got this really, really cute sage color. I love like sage green. I feel like I'm going to want to incorporate that in some way in our uh, son's room. I just, I really like sage, but we'll see. Anyway, they're like a really nice waffle fabric. So they're not going to make your feet like hot. So I was, I was a yellow fan. I liked the yellows, the greens, the light blues, but mostly dominant was yellow um, in my kids' rooms. I don't know. I thought it was so bright and sunny and cheery. And they are super cushiony memory foam. Um, and then your feet can also breathe because they're just like a slide. Anti-slip on. I will say toward the end of my pregnancy, because I was so friggin' swollen, I wore slippers 24 seven and I'm like, come for me, like to work to, I had an actual job work, like, you know, where I had to be there every day. I know it was a long time ago on the bottom i just think they're absolutely freaking perfect the perfect spring summer house slipper i don't know if i'm gonna wear makeup today just because i am gonna be in the house <laughs> folding laundry and just like prepping for tomorrow but i did get this new lip thing that i saw on tiktok it's just actually from covergirl it's the outlast lip stain and i saw people using it as a lip liner that like really lasts and she used the color i don't know who it was i apologize Shuggy girl and it's just like the perfect nudie pink color and i'm all about finding a good lip liner that will not rub off <laughs> so we'll try this at some point together but it looked really good on her after eating and living okay my last i might have saved the best for last <laughs> i have thought about buying this like most summers and i finally just caved especially since we don't have a pool anymore hopefully one day listen a couple days ago when it was like literally in the sun it felt like 80 i went out and like tanned on the porch for a little bit it was the day i didn't vlog i put sunscreen on i like just laid out listened to a podcast <laughs> and i just love it i love laying in the sun but it Me gets too. hot so all my people out there who don't have a pool but want to lay in the sun and tan and not get hot just get yourself a little mini tanning pool i bet this you your dog's for 25 there. bucks i, bet you I think it's normally like 40 to 50. Hopefully it's still on sale when I post this, but look at it. Just look at it. So it's the perfect individual size. You just put water in the bottom. It has like a headrest. Um, people rave about this. It has. Uh, all right, guys, but seriously, with all due respect, look at the model. You always have to like get a little sus when you see the model and they're tiny and skinny and I don't know. Alex, are you going to fit in that? I don't know. Because you always see... I mean, if, listen, I deal with that in pool floats too. You see the, the model and, and the pool float is laying nice and above the water. And then you get into it and not only can you not get on it, but it, it uh, drowns, it sinks. Really great reviews. The quality is supposed to be really size. good. Like I'm just going to plop pool this on my porch stuff. and lay out. <laughs> listen to some music. Have a nice little glass of water, a little lemon water or something, and just enjoy. They have different colors. The cheapest was the blue. I'm like, let's just go for it. Yeah, Boy, mom energy. I don't know. So I just, uh, I'm really excited to try this. I'll obviously vlog when I do. Oh, I'm the next sure hot she will. day. It's on. 
it's on. So that's my really random Amazon haul of the month. Let me know if you guys have any good Amazon finds that you found recently. I love sharing these things. And now we must fold laundry, so. Oh great, I bet you have more it. music. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut this out. as you saw and okay you guys I just went ahead and folded the laundry as you saw and I have a few things just set out here for the trip because why put it away just a legging set with um, an aloe sweatshirt uh, that's probably good for like a travel day and then for like the main driving? day i have my favorite pair of pants from the one loved babe boutique and then like this matching oversized t-shirt that just it's it just matches oversized. so well it's been like a go-to outfit lately and it's super comfy also you guys we got bruno a dog bed for in our Brandy. bedroom he used to sleep in his crate but honestly he's just been sleeping with us now now that he's like potty trained he just loves sleeping in the room with us so he's either on the bed usually or Bella's on in the bed this little bed this is from amazon like, it's so the cute covers. it looks like a little couch it's got like quilted and it's a nice um fabric that's not too hot because bruno runs hot <laughs> and it's orthodox. well and they like the um they like oh bruni can you you can't see him because i'm in the way hold on let's see all right let me let me just keep myself down there anyways oh bruni they like the little bolsters that's what the dogs love um at least mine do anyways Pedic. You Brownie. like your new bed. Brownie. I'm shocked. We only had it for a few days. Oh my god. Like he I'm telling you. It dogs love beds. Are you it's kidding? got like Aww. dog power in it. <laughs> and I think yeah. he likes how it has arms because he'll lay his head on the arms. Yes. So we put it in here honestly not thinking he would lay on it. We're like, we can try it. He likes to be on the bed with us or he'll go into the bathroom to cool down on the tile floor. <laughs> That's kind of like his little uh, routine. But uh, yeah, we got up, we both got up in the night to pee and we both look over and we're like, oh my God, he's on the bed. And we were so excited. He loves it. Honestly, I was really surprised. I didn't think he would like it. Cause like when we try new dog beds, he just, he likes what he likes and new things he usually doesn't care about. So I'll link the dog bed too. Cause there's something magical in it. Okay, so need to pack my toiletry bag i'm not gonna bring anything dramatic like i'm gonna probably bring my really pro tip if you have to travel a lot just keep a toiletry bag stocked with the things that you use just simple that's what I natural makeup routine that i've been doing with the throw in the mix Except tinted makeup. spf i don't have like two super quick and simple okay so this is my wildly Damn. is that really the simple for real? routine that i'm gonna pack for our little trip. This moisturizer, as you can see, it's getting pretty low. This is great if you are oily, but it still gives you some nice moisture. I'll link it, it's so good. And then you guys know I've been obsessed with the Color Science Flex SPF. These are tinted, but they blend into your skin. Like they come out, I mean, I've shown them. They come out white and then it adjusts to your skin tone. I mix the medium and the fair. And I hope you don't mind. This is great for winter. This is great for in the middle. And then you get your SPF, you get some coverage, and it dries down to a beautiful skin-like finish. You don't even have to set with powder. And then for blush, this little uh, Color Science blush stick in a violet haze. And then I also have the bronzer. And then mascara, my favorite, the Tartlet with my lash curler. Some NYX Thicket and Stick It Brow Gel. And if I feel like I need to brighten my under eyes, the Ole Hendrickson Banana Bright CC Stick is great for just a little under eye skin treatment. And then just the Laneige Sleeping Lip Mask for nighttime and morning. That is the makeup I'm gonna bring. Many hours later. Bruno and I are taking a walk. The beauty is that it's like 5.30, so we're gonna have a late dinner. I've got a bag of poop in my hand. And for some reason, I thought it was Fake a lot colder it. than it was. And now I'm sweating. <laughs> I had on my Sherpa jacket. <laughs> and now I have it tied around my waist and I'm sweating. At least I have flip flops on. I know it makes no sense. There's my jacket. Okay, guys, we just got back from our walk and I am cleaning the racks in the oven. I just had to show you guys how good this works. Cause like, look at this. And then look at this spotless spot here. So I've been soaking it in soapy warm water and I am using this, what is this called? The Power Paste from Scrub Daddy. Oh my God, this is powerful. I don't have the old scrubby it came with, but oh my gosh, guys, it's like, this stuff is so yucky. <laughs> this is part of our spring cleaning journey. Yard did um, the self cleaning on the oven even, yeah. um, for the first time yesterday and just like wiped down the inside and leave now it I'm in the oven. This. And oh, like it's all just coming up right off. I should really put gloves on <laughs> so my hands don't get more dry because I'm gonna be here for a hot minute. 
but wow, I am so impressed. I forgot that I had this. I have not used this in a while. You know if you get hot and sweaty just from cleaning in the house, there's a problem. All right, so let me just, this was three hours ago. Let's refresh. I love your hair. You and I are so much alike, even though I am 30 years older than you. I'm very sad at Cheryl Duncan 5158. Very disappointing. All right. Well, there weren't really any good comments, um, so we'll just leave it here. She is on her way to see her in-laws, which is nice. Family's important. Um, and we'll see what she's got for us next week. And that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for stopping by, and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye!